So, what is up guys and welcome back to another video. In today's video I'm going to be showing you how to unlock the new gun that has come out for Cold War Zombies. Or Cold War in general for Warzone as well. Uh, it's called the Carf 2. Now, many people might be like, oh it's going to be probably a, you know, arse ache to unlock it. But it's not actually that hard. You basically need to get uh, 250 long shot kills with a tactical rifle. So the best way to do it is obviously on Cold War Outbreak Zombies. Now, what you want to do is you want to basically make a tactical rifle of your choice i went for the m16 as it is my by my opinion the best gun in zombies and uh basically just made a class with it i put four times scope on it because i'm going to be shooting in the distance so i want to see the zombies and then i headed basically over into outbreak zombies um i do recommend going in solos as you know obviously with people it might be a bit harder what you want to do basically is either get a vehicle and or, or a motorbike or you know one of these uh snow skis or whatever and you basically just want to make like a little train of zombies like I did, you know, make like a little horde and then drive away from them and you just want to shoot them and, you know, from like a distance, obviously. Uh, if it says critical kill, that means you've not got it. What you're looking for is a, on the side for it to say long shot kill. That means you've actually shot the zombie in a certain distance and you've basically got one of the 250 kills. Um, again, if it does say critical kill, then that just means you've shot in the head. That doesn't count. Um... So obviously this is one of the ways to do it, you know, just run around, make a train of zombies and uh, obviously you can always keep track of your progress by going into the create class, going on the gun, pressing actually on the gun and then going down into tactical rifle, see how much you've done out of the 250. Um, so yeah, this is one way to do it. Uh, another way to do it is, you know, you can be boring going to, uh, you know, Cold War zombie, uh, Cold War multiplayer, set the back of the map of uh, probably Nuketown. And probably get sniped by the other guy off the other team uh, you know camping at the other side of the map which is the boring way to do it and it's probably the harder way to do it as well um another way you can do it is again outbreak zombies is going up and down the hill so you basically get in like that you know distance from the zombies and also you know i do believe hellhounds do not work on this uh, for this tactical kill i'm not too sure about it but uh, i guess this is one way of doing it this is like the fast way of doing it i'd say uh, you know, I unlocked it like pretty quick. I think it took like half an hour. My game did crash, uh, you know, halfway through this recording. But um, the good thing is the progress does not get deleted. So if your game does crash or something does happen, the progress will always stay on there. So you don't have to worry about anything like that. Again, I do recommend checking the like, you know, the progress. Although I was only checking it just to see, you know, how much I've done. Uh, but it's a good way to check, you know, how much you still need to do and you know etc but i hope this video has helped you obviously you can't change the gun in throughout the game so i had to actually go out and should prove to you that i've actually unlocked it but like i said i hope you enjoyed this video smash like button subscribe around here if it has helped you leave a comment down below uh, if you need any help again leave a comment down below and then i'll try and answer it but yeah thanks for watching hope you have a nice day and peace